Hey guys. What? What am I doing? I mean... Am I really doing anything right? So this doesn't feel like I'm doing anything right anymore. It doesn't feel like I'm doing anything. I just... I'm just alive. Not even. Like... I'm... I don't even know. I'm just here. I exist. But... That's it. I don't... I just... I wish I knew. I... I feel lost. Like I got... disconnected from something. I just don't know. I'll be so real. People ask me what's wrong, and I tell them everything's fine. <laughs> because there's this quote that I heard somebody tell me once. I'll hide my demons so you don't have to see them, but won't that hurt you? Better me than you, you don't deserve this. That's, <laughs> that's how I feel about a lot of my problems, honestly. I don't tell you guys everything because you don't need to know everything. You don't need to know all the different issues that go on in my head because, well, if I'm as overwhelmed and insane from them as I am, <laughs> I don't want to give that to anybody else. I'll hide my demons so you don't have to see them. Better me than you. It's messed up. I'll admit that, but... <laughs> I'll admit that it's messed up, but you know, um... Like I said, I, I care about you guys. Probably more than I care about myself, honestly. You guys deserve better. I'm not going anywhere. I'm not leaving, but... You guys are so much better than me. Honestly, the fact that y'all are even still here is amazing, because I don't feel like I've deserved any of this. Well, I just, <laughs> I don't know, I don't know, I don't know what to do, I just sit here I guess, admire the sky and enjoy the space. So 
That's the problem with trying to reach out to me is if you ask me what's wrong, I'm not going to tell you. <laughs> I can't. My better judgment will keep me from doing it. Maybe it's a flaw. It's probably a flaw, honestly. Not telling people my problems. The only time where I'll ever really be open is when I'm just talking to an empty void into a camera like this. Because I can be as open as I want to myself. But I can't fucking do that with other people. Because I'm always afraid I'll say the wrong thing or... Maybe I'm not feeling what I actually think I'm feeling. I don't even know what I'm feeling anymore in my own damn head. <sighs> I think my brain has this lovely little trick of trying to block out trauma all the time. What, what do you do when you become desensitized to the concept of death? Like really, what do you do? What do you, what do, you do with that? I'm sorry, that's a bombshell. I'm not really dropping that. But I was thinking about that last night because, like, my grandma's dying, right? She's in hospital. She's in, like, nursing care. And she might just straight decide to stop eating and starve herself because she hates living. And, like, I just don't care. Like, what's wrong with me, man? I mean, to be fair, I've had, like... I've had a lot of fan members die. I've had a lot of pets that I care about die. <laughs> every fucking waking moment of my childhood was um every almost every year there was somebody who died. It was either an animal or a, or a person. That's. That's really fucked up. Thinking about that in retrospect. Um. I'm sorry. I'll just. I'll just go. I. I'm keeping you here too long. I should. I should wrap this up. Um. I. To everybody who's still here, thank you. And to everybody who sent a donation my way. Thank you. It helps a lot more than you know. Like, a lot. And if anybody else is able to, I mean, it's it's appreciated. I, I want to get out of my hell. I would like to escape this hell someday. When I can afford to live on my own. I, uh, appreciate every single donation. And every single follower, every single like, every comment, you guys are all great and amazing. And like I said, I'm not going anywhere. I'm still here. I'm still going to be making videos and shit. But I think you all really do deserve someone better. All of you. Take care.